Ugh, hello! Hello, it's been a while, hasn't it? I hope you're having a wonderful day today, but I, um, I was actually consuming one of my favorite little snacks, and I decided, you know what, I'm going to share a few of my recent obsessions with the world. So, ugh. Yeah, okay, let me just explain this. Yes, I recently came out of the shower. I have pajama pants on. Oh, that's, that's actually one of my obsessions, you'll see. But yes, I am wearing a scarf with my robe. Not exactly classy, but really, who am I trying to impress right now? Guys, we all know that I'm going to be alone on Valentine's Day. But that's all right, because I choose that be, to be that way. Anyways, obsession number one. This is called a pickle pack. I don't know about you, but I adore pickles. They're just, they have, one, they have to be kosher dill, obviously. But, oh, the sweet ones, like, they just do not sit well with me. But, like, my mother finds the most clever little things. This, these people decided to pack little individual cups of pickles. And I bring them to school, and obviously, like, yeah, I mean, I do stink up a room with my pickle juice, whatever. You know, again... I'm going to be alone on Valentine's Day, but you know what, it's like, oh, very strong, but it's delicious, like, I don't know, obsession number one, pickle packs, like, beautiful, anyways, obsession number two, If you're one of those people that has never, ever tried Nutella, leave. Leave this universe. Leave. Just leave. Speaking of Nutella, my mother also, where she found the pickle packs, she found little containers of Nutella. Perfect for on the go. I mean, it, it's, it's delicious. It's like, and I like to be that, like, little pain in the butt. And during my Italian class, I'll be like, oh, it's Nutella time. And I'll open it up and I'll eat things. But... I mean, look at this. It's like so cute. It's like a, it's a, like a, it's a, it's a mock jar, you know, like, oh, wait, let me just untwist my Nutella. Oh, wait, it's a personal little packet for me. One, it, a good excuse to not share. Two, like, I could just, <coughs> sorry, I could just bring this anywhere. The pickle, the pickles are making my digestive system crazy. All right, Nutella, buy it, eat it. Don't eat it with the pickles unless you're like me who likes to try new things, but just don't. Obsession number three. Now, this one's a little bit strange, if the previous two haven't been strange enough. This is Vicks Vapo Inhaler. What you do is, I feel, like a, I feel like a crack whore when I use this, but it's just so good. You untwist it, and then you just go like this. And your nasal passages are clear. I mean... God, who thinks of these things? You know, like, I always thought I was, like, the wise-ass who was like, yeah, you know, if I invented anything, I'd invent little windshield wipers for glasses. No, these people, like, think of creating packs of pickles, mini things of Nutella, and, like, crack cocaine for people who don't want to have, you know, nasal congestion. Oh, whoo, ooh, I could, like, breathe easily now. Anyways, um, two more things. I haven't used them recently, but I just liked the name. I can't find the other one, but these are Toasty Toes. You, they're, they're foot warmers, but I just thought that it was a really creative thing to be like, oh, Toasty Toes. And then the hand warmers are called Hotties, and I was like, huh, I get the alliteration. Don't worry. But, okay, number, th number five, last number great like that I like. I don't, all right, hold on. All right, okay. Look at these babies. All right, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. These are my ever so attractive, like, what are they? I don't even, I don't even know what they are. They're like long john, they're long john underpants. So yeah, I am in my underpants right now, hoo hoo. But, and if you notice, they're from Victoria's Secret. Like, obviously these things are old, you know? So, ladies, if, I mean, great, oh, I wear these underneath my pajamas, and they're just the most beautiful things ever. But ladies, if your man on Valentine's Day, I wouldn't know what that's like, but if your man on Valentine's Day 
or pre-Valentine's Day is like, you know, he wants to get a little jiggy with it, and he really, he's been hinting at you to go to Victoria's Secret. Fear no more, ladies. You can do what I do. And instead of getting a sexy bra, you could just get these warm, cuddly, fantastic long johns. Ugh. Like, obviously, Victoria's real secret was that she loved to be warm. She doesn't love, she doesn't adore to be naked. She adores being warm. So, that's my video. I mean, very pointless, but isn't life pointless? Think about it.